Casey Martin was a professional golfer with a bad leg. Due to a circulatory disorder, walking the course for 18 holes of golf was painful for Martin. It even posed a serious risk that he might fracture his leg. Despite this disability, he was an excellent golfer. He asked the PGA, the Professional Golfers Association, for permission to use a golf cart during the tournaments. The PGA said no. Martin took his case to court. He invoked a law requiring that organizations make reasonable accommodations for people with disabilities, provided the accommodation did not fundamentally alter the nature of the activity. Many of the great golfers of the past testified in court that walking the course was an essential part of the game. The case went all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. The court ruled in Martin's favor. They said he did have a right to use a golf cart in the tournaments. The court ruled that the essence of golf was the ability to make shots, not the ability to walk the course. Critics argued that giving Martin a right to ride in a golf cart while competing in professional tournaments would be like giving a disabled basketball player who was a great shooter the right to play in the NBA while riding up and down the court in a motorized scooter. What do you think? Do you agree with the reasoning of the court or with the reasoning of the critics? <laughs>